The CAT Scholarship is a scholarship from Organization of Catholic Church in Germany. And this scholarship is targeted at students or researchers fr from developing countries in Africa, Asia, Latin America, Southern and Eastern Europe, and also from the Middle East. Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Alice Richa. To all new and returning subscribers, thank you for supporting, for continually supporting my channel. If you are discovering my channel for the first time, I'm Alice Rita and I record tutorials on ImageJ program, which is for image analysis. And recently I've graduated from my program. So now I'm sharing content about postgraduate opportunities abroad. So if you're interested in my content, please click on the subscribe button. If you enjoy today's content, please engage with my video. I love it when there is engagement on my video. And if you don't know what to write, just tell me where you are watching from. I'll be happy to know how far you to promote this content. And then let's get to today's content. So the CAD scholarship, it's categorized into three. There is the CAD scholarship one program. There is this CAD scholarship two program. And there is the CAD Eastern Europe program. Thing that is common about these three programs is in order for you to be able to apply for any of these programs, you need to be first a Catholic or a Christian. But the priority is given to the Catholics. So if you are from other denomination of the Christian religion, you are also you might also be considered there is a clause that you might be considered. And then another thing that is important is that you demonstrate the knowledge of the German language. But what makes these three different, uh, these three categories different? Let's get into it. The CAD, which is K A A D, CAD scholarship, not D A A D, not DAD. The CAD scholarship, as I've mentioned, is from the Catholic, is from the Organization of Catholic Church in Germany, and they are providing financial assistance to students from the developing countries, from. Asia, Africa, Latin America, Middle East, Eastern and Southern Europe. So in order for you to then apply for any of these programs, let me first explain the different program to you. The Catholic, the Kahade Scholarship One program, it's targeted at students that are applying from their home countries. And from their home countries, I mean the countries that falls within the region I've mentioned earlier. And you already obtained a university degree and you have some working experience and you are a catholic you've you've you have a proof that you can demonstrate your knowledge of the german language and you have an above average performance in your research or dig or study and in order for you to be qualified for this scholarship you need to demonstrate that you're actively involved in church and social engagement. So if you are a chorister, an altar boy in the church, all these give you extra points when they are uh, assessing or evaluating your application. And also if you, let's assume you don't engage at all in the church, but maybe you do some social volunteering, maybe like all these um, uh, working in old people's home, helping out at the motherless or baby's home freely, not paid engagements. So if you are involved in this type of activity, the, this will weigh your, this will help your application to have more weight. So these are the category of people that are targeted and this support all study program. So if you are looking to study for a master program in any field, as long as you've already done this for your, bach for your bachelor degree and you are working in this line or imagine you're a nurse and you want to do a master's in nursing, you have a proof that you have the nursing experience and that you are looking to do this master's in order to be able to further your uh, career in nursing. So all these criteria are the things that will be considered when they are making, when they are assessing your application. In order for you to be able to apply, you the application form is online. However, during the stage of interview you are going to be interviewed in the uh, ad, with, uh within there will be a delegated body of committee that will interview you in your own country and send the evaluation reports to the depending if you're applying from africa or asia to the african or asian office 
at the Kahabe headquarters in Bonn, in Germany. So if you're applying for the Kahabe Scholarship 2 program, this one you cannot apply from outside of Germany. The Kahabe Scholarship Program 2 is targeted at students that are already present in Germany, meaning they are already enrolled in a full-time study, and they are from the developing countries in Africa, Asia, Latin America, Middle East, Latin America, Middle East, Southern and Eastern Europe is the same set of uh, country that are targeted. However, you've already you already enrolled in your in your master or PhD program in Germany. And in order for you to be able to apply, you need to apply for this scholarship program within the 10 months that within the first 10 months that you have arrived in Germany. However, this one is slightly tricky. You are not applying from home, right? So this particular scholarship program too is targeted at students that are actively engaged in their Catholic community. So there is something called there is something called the Catholic University Community, which is KHG. So you'll be hearing something like Kahage. That is the community of Catholic uh, students, university students that are Catholics. And there is the other one that is also called ESG, this ESG. So the ESG is the Catholic student community. So when you go to church, you sometimes sit on the pamphlet, on the small pamphlet that there is the ESG and the Kahage. These are always joined together. So like when I was studying in Göttingen, in University of Göttingen, Germany, I had the financial support from CAHA, from CAD scholarship two program because I was already in Germany and enrolled in a full time uh, master course and I applied at the beginning of my second semester. I did not, I wasn't aware of this scholarship until my one of my community leader explained to me that oh, since you are always here volunteering at the uh, CAHA gay community and you need financial assistance, why not apply to the, car, uh, car, to the CAD scholarship? And so I applied and I, I did my interview and they nominated me forward to get the scholarship. So this scholarship also provides, it's for a year, so I was able to get that financial support that I needed for my master program. So if you're already in Germany and you're just arriving, look for your, car, your Catholic community and be engaged in this community, sometimes they have some fun events. When I was there, when I was in Göttingen, I remember that there are after mass in the evening. We usually meet in the community um, uh, space. There is a small room in, uh, below, uh, in one of the, beside the offices where we just meet either for like in the Christmas time we have some mood wine, some biscuits, and then we uh, enable us like a thirty or one hour, thirty minutes to one hour space to be able to engage with other Catholic students to check on each other, and sometimes. We have some big sales in order to raise funds. Like for instance, like this Pakistani flood that happened recently. If I was in Germany, I'm sure that they would have organized. Although I am not, I'm no longer following the event, but I'm sure that they would have organized something like um, funding to support the community that are experiencing the flood in Pakistan. So all these things are activities that I enjoy volunteering. So those are the things that. I enjoy doing and that helped me in my scholarship application for the Day Scholarship 2 program. Who are the people that is targeted for the Eastern European, the category 3? This is, this is specifically targeted at people that have the German knowledge, the knowledge of the German language. They are from the Eastern and Middle or Southern parts of Europe and that they're already working, so mostly researchers or people that are looking to come to Germany for like a six month stay to collect data. So for all this information that I've shared today, it's clearly written on their website. So please read the information in case things have changed as at, uh, by the time you are assessing the platform. So what is the catch with the Kahade Scholarship? The Kahade Scholarship app provides you financial support so that during your study time in Germany, you are not financially burdened and you can study with as little as zero stress during your study period. However, because this money is their indirect contribution towards the development of your country, you are expected to go back to your home country after immediately after the completion of your study. 
in some instances you are allowed to stay behind to do your phd and you have to provide information to the kahade office that this is uh this is where I am, this is where I'm doing, and this is how long it will take me to complete this. And the office normally follows up to know how you are doing and if the study is going on as planned. If you finish your master's in Germany and you are looking to do a PhD still using the Karate Scholarship, the Karate Scholarship still offers financial support for students, for Catholic students or Christian students to be able to pursue their PhD scholarship, uh, PhD program. So they also provide uh, you can apply through your Kage community for the PhD scholarship to continue your study. But please note that with this scholarship, you have to go back home for a, a minimum of two years before you are then allowed to be financially not inclined to pay back the Kage scholarship. And if you are ever br browsing a website that is in German, I would recommend that you use a Google browser so that you can click on the translate function uh, icon on the, on the on the Chrome. So it will switch the language for you from German to English and this you can easily get information. Three things, the key information from today's video is that the Kahade Scholarship is a scholarship from the Organization of Catholics Church of Catholic Church in Germany and it targets this scholarship at postgraduate or researchers from Africa, Asia, Latin America, Middle East, Southern and Eastern Europe. And that this scholarship is categorized into three, the scholarship one program, which is targeted at students that are still making the application from their own country. The second targets at students that are already in Germany and they've arrived in less than 10 months and are Catholics or Christian. And the third one, at the Middle Eastern uh, Europe, uh, Europe program. So if you find my content useful, please click the, the subscribe button. Your subscription, your engagement on my video motivates me to do my research for the next video. And until next time, bye.